Welcome guys to another video. Can you find Maiden 2 in this position? The first thing that you can see is that you are down a lot of points in material. But, and he is Maiden 1 in this position. So what do you do? Well, you can see that the knight's being protected by the pawn. But look at this. It's in a very, very, very powerful position. Attacking both these squares. So getting a rook up here is great. So you could go rook f1. Now, the thing about the queen here is that these queen and rook look pretty dominating. Because if you let him have one move, one separate move, then he'll checkmate you. So you just have to do checks or fo or forced moves. That's why rook f1 is a great move. And he can't even block it because the queen's the queen can't block it. So he's forced to go to king h2. And like I said in all my other videos, forced moves are great. Because it means... Just like force move, he only has one move to go to, so it's already limiting the amount of squares he has. Now, this wouldn't be possible without the pawn here being the MVP protecting the knight, because now the rook, I mean the king, has nowhere to go. The rook is blocking these squares, and he can't go here because of the knight. So all you gotta do is give a checkmate like that. The reason why it's a checkmate is the knight's protecting protecting the rook, and the king cannot go anywhere, even though he might has a lot of pieces. They're all pretty far away from the king. Thank you guys so much for watching and have an amazing day.